relatable. What's up? Valentine's edition. Valentine's Day, the absolute best holiday. Just love. Don't Listen, you love love? Fuck love, but give me gifts. <laughs> On, on game. I'm just Money. playing. I absolutely love Valentine's <laughs> Day. It is my favorite um, pagan, rich, white man, capitalistic, it hasn't been my unnecessary favorite. holiday. Valentine's Day didn't exist. Man or no man. Now. It's my shit. Okay, so we're going to talk about... <laughs> Um, things to do for, this is really for guys and girls actually, mm -hmm. um, but Valentine's Day is a very special day of the year. You want to make sure that you come in correct, um, whether you have a long-term relationship or a short-term relationship, situationship, one of those like, what we got don't need to be explained, you know, that bullshit. We got something for everybody, baby mm -hmm. mama, baby dads, um, so yeah, let's just get right into it. Okay. We're going to talk about gifts that you can get your man. And then we're also going to talk about um, how to get ready for your man for Valentine's Day. Yes. Which I think we should all know, but we're just going to go over it. And then we're also going to talk about some uh, sweet things that you guys can do. So, male or female, appropriate for both. Mm -hmm. Let's get right into it. Okay. Oh, the first thing when you're get ready. Going, yes, so get ready. So you want to get your nails done. Mm -hmm. You want to get your hair done, your eyebrows done, um, your toes, of course, done. You know, men like toes. Mm -hmm. So keep them cute, white, red, pink, something like that. Um, so this is really for like the ladies, how to like spoil your man or whatever. Uh, I definitely would suggest getting like candles and rose petals, Dollar Tree rose petals, not real rose petals, because you probably gonna like smash and dash on them. So lay on the bed, yeah. lay in the bathroom. My ex used to put a little trail, you know, sprinkle it cutely across the little room. That was a vibe. Um, what else? Cook for him in an apron only, like. Literally dress it up, make it real. Hold on, I'll be right back. One eternity later. I'm just gonna edit that. Yeah. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? This is a whole extra small. Some heels is supposed to be. You gotta see the ass poking. Feel me? It's the extra small so that he can see this extra big ass. And these extra big breasts. Maybe a red one, though. Yeah, maybe a red one. This one is pink. But, like, if you just do this and some heels, girl, you probably have a husband February 15th. Um, massages. Everybody loves massages. Massages. For Get guys you, and for girls. Yes. Shea butter, want. coconut oil. Set you up a little table. Use the fucking... Use the desk in your you, house. You don't need much. Put a sheet on it. A big blanket. Put the little candles all around. It's something about a candle. Make sure it's scented. Have it smelling like something, not blunts and ass. Have it smelling like roses. Um, I don't know. Not on like apple cinnamon. Something good. They got a, a lot of good selections at the Bath and Body Works White Barn. Get yes. those candles. Um, so yeah, massages after you cooking for him or whatever or before. Dance for him. And I'm talking about tonight i be a naughty girl some, and awesome sierra type yes <laughs> you gotta do a do a what's back that, what's, that, what's that song she um do a back what's that song she had that music video for uh future what was it a long time ago body party ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, shit. Ooh, 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 ooh. that and do it to that that used to be my show okay um make sure your outfit is together so Whatever your clothes game looks like, whatever, have something, you know, theme appropriate, red, black, white, um, what else, pink, something real cute, cute, you know, scandalous, whatever. Something you know your man will like, yes. or your woman will like, but also something that you truly, you know, won't make you uncomfortable. Girl, get uncomfortable. Pain is beauty. Fuck it. Um, what else? Some wine and some liquor. Get something that both of y'all can sip on all night. Put a little ice bucket. It could be a makeshift ice bucket. It doesn't matter. Get something that both of y'all could, you know, get turned to the max to turn that bitch diagonal while you at it. And um, it'd be a great help to get to where you got to go for the end of the night. Um, bake his favorite dessert. So I don't know if, like, your man likes sweets or pies or maybe he likes 
fucking, I don't know, Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Make that, sis. Whatever it is. Make it. Find out what it is. If it's you, you, you can even you can me. even no. I was about to say you can even do like a simple at home fondue type thing. Get and some strawberries, can, strawberries and get the chocolate going in that shit. Whipped cream is simple. Yep. You can do it. Don't have to be. It don't even so, have to be baked. That's true. It's, that, I mean, it's not. It's not it. super super hard. I'm right. Literally no. on the box. I make the best German <laughs> chocolate cake. Oh, you. I'm not talking about a box cake. I'm talking about some chips. I'm like scratch them. Okay. Yeah. Some whipping to work. It. All right. Um. Last, my favorite two, costumes and lingerie. So, just depending on how much he deserves that. You feel what <laughs> I'm saying? You feel what I'm coming to with it? You know what I'm saying? I don't know whose son would ever see me in this. Probably doesn't exist. Um, And yeah, costumes. I think men just love the element of like surprise and getting with a woman they've never, you know, seen before. Which is probably why these fucking Especially if you're cheap. like the shy type and you pop out of that. He's gonna yeah. Like with some bunny ears or a, I don't know a, be cupid bitch take it there do what you gotta do um cause I'll come in with some angel wings and a halo and be the devil I will she will yeah so okay those are just some ways to like help get ready or whatever mm -hmm. just your little checklist to do this um trips or not even really just trips but like things uh, I guess events things to do right mm -hmm. so we'll go into that and then we'll go into gifts so I was saying for people that have like I guess uh situationships uh really really flex uh inflexible job uh what is it what's the word I'm looking for schedules, schedules. yeah like uh you know jobs that don't let you get off like that you have to work that night or whatever or you know you have kids whatever the case may be um a staycation is a great way to still spend valentine's day um not spend copious amounts of cash but still make it really really special you know you can do something as simple as you know set up like a little picnic you know something that y'all don't typically do on a regular set up a picnic you know, is do actually something really you, dope yeah do something y'all yeah. typically you want, wouldn't do don't do but not like a pic like go to the park or go to the beach if you have a beach in your no, city or but, yeah, yeah like a, a cute place um if you in Sarasota, go to the Ringling. You're in Tallahassee, go to Tom Brown or fucking Lake Ella or something like that. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. So, I was thinking that it would be really, really cute to have, like, the staycation be, like, in a hotel. Who doesn't love to go to a hotel, even if it's in your city? Um, I've had somebody do this for me before, and it was, like, amazing. Like, it's just the vibe. Especially yeah, the Valentine's Day. You don't day. feel like you're at home. You feel like you're out of town, even though you're not. And then, oop tripping you feel like you're home even when you're not mm -hmm. um order room service bring your wine with you tell your boo you know what pack a bag we going somewhere Put don't tell them where it is on do not disturb D, D. okay and honestly you probably get oh y'all have a way better time if you put the stones on do not disturb mm -hmm. i think you should also um blindfold them and put earmuffs on them so that way it's like it's more of like the element of surprise now don't get kidnapped bitch okay don't get kidnapped bitch <laughs> but what i'm saying is it just makes them feel so much more special. Like, oh my God, they went out their way, child. Bandana it up, earmuffs. And, and for my guys boom. out there, if your girl, if you think your girl doesn't want all this, she does. She literally does. She does. I don't know a bitch that don't. Show Put her, her in the trunk. Like, like, not not for real. What? I'm literally joking. That's a surprise. Like, just put her in the trunk. You ever seen that movie? No. Jawbreaker. They put their friend in the trunk. They was trying to surprise her, but she died in the trunk. Basically, but. just just show love. Yeah. Time um. Can. Gotta bring wine, liquor, whatever. Gotta have music. So have DJ iPhone on deck. Um. And then when they're packing this bag, make sure they have all the things they're gonna need for you guys to enjoy the amenities, mm -hmm. uh, such as bathing suit if yes. it's you know hot if tub. it's hot or even a pool, yeah, mm -hmm. hot tubs, um, jacuzzis or whatever. Make sure she has I don't know her fur coat if it's gonna be cold if you guys are gonna be going out, um, and using the hotel amenities or whatever. Like if you live anywhere, if you live in like Pensacola or like North Florida, if you live in Mississippi or Alabama, whatever. All of those hotels, like the casino resorts, like IP, and all of them, they are literally a vacation in themselves. You buy one room and you can use all their amenities. You can use the casino, you can use the spa, you can use the hot tub, this big ass pool with all these slides and their restaurants. And they have so many amenities. It's a shame to not take advantage of that. So, um, yeah. What else? What else? Uh, blah, 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 blah. Of course, bed with rose petals. We said that. So now let's get into gifts. Gifts. Yes. 
a lot of these are geared um towards like men like what to get your man because honestly i think and i've talked to enough men to hear we t they tired of getting ties they tired of getting socks belts and wallets and let me just say this because i wasn't even sure it's very okay to get your man something for valentine's day don't yeah. think it's just for the women like men they be, they want stuff yeah too. they be looking for something whether I it's mean, appreciation whether it's like physical gifts they, they're looking for something don't get no bum ass bitch no gift though like since if he's just sliding you he he can get a h uh vd happy valentine's day he can get a text but if he's like special get him something and some beer so simple as that like make a little basket for him and put some beer different in kinds there. though yeah like whatever he likes yeah whatever yeah. if he even likes beer yeah because you know um bacon roses i heard about this on pinterest it was so cute so some like adorable super crafty white girl just decided to take three packs of bacon roll them up cook them in either the microwave or the oven and they when they curl up like that they look like roses and then she just put stems on them and gave it to him as a bouquet and he like fucking died about it she also sprinkled some brown sugar on it which bitch i eat that i'd rather have that in flowers and that's just the kind of girl i am um so if you don't want to do baskets with the beers, you can do baskets with Henny and shots. If every boy likes Henny. Every girl likes Henny. Everybody. Yeah. Everybody likes Henny. It's more than every black person. Shit. The, Mr. Hennessy is a white man. So yeah. <laughs> I mean. Um, nudes. And not just like regular nudes, y'all. Yeah. Like, y'all could literally hold, on, please. Y'all could literally be like this, okay? Picture I'm naked. Don't picture that shit. Okay. You can literally rock the I killed my husband robe. Draped up, dripped out, body. You know what I'm saying? It got a little stash that go <laughs> right there. It is. They come in all different colors on Amazon. Cute little photo shoot. Open it up for them. You know what I'm saying? Do what you got to do to get your husband. Turn it around. Do, you know what I'm saying? Drop it low. Do whatever. I'm going to actually stay in this room for the video. Speaking of nudes. <laughs> Send him some nudes. <laughs> Shit. Whatever. You um, can even get your man a calendar. But like, I know someone who's done this. I did it. For the wrong <laughs> motherfucker. It's cool. But they weren't new. Explain the calendar. The calendar, um, it was actually not for Valentine's Day. It was for his birthday. Mm -hmm. And um, it was called Your Girl for All Seasons because I had just watched grease and you know she's like i'll be your girl for all seasons all the year through your girl for all seasons because i love you gotta see it i don't know yes i love to be anything to you I think they get it. good okay so basically um it was literally her saying like bitch i'm gonna be whatever you need january to damn December. You don't have to get nobody else because I'm going to be a different bitch every day. Different hair, different costumes, different wigs. There's no need for you to step outside of the box. I can be everything you want. I can change outfits and it doesn't matter what season it is. She was letting you know in the, whenever they made that movie, the 70s, that you don't need nobody else. So, I made this stupid bastard a calendar that basically let him know the same shit. So I dressed up. So January, it was a wintry look. February, I got my stupid ass in the damn bathtub and put roses all over the I wish we had it shit. so we could. It's, I got it. I just ain't showing him. I want to see it. In March, I got my stupid ass in the grass with a thong on. I wore a green suit jacket and had ants biting my ass I'll just, so it, I so I get, it just so I could get... Just so I could get... Just so I could get a St. Patrick's Day. Ain't shit about me, Irish, y'all. Why I'm in the grass with my ass out. Hmm. Cause you love that man. Did, did. Um, April, I had a whole umbrella right here. And then I also had the Easter ear uh the Easter bunny ears, breast out with a little pom pom on my ass with some drawers on. May was Mother's Day. I booted it over in the kitchen. And I had a broom and a mop, and I was taking cookies out the oven, because that's what mothers do. You're funny. And I'm hilarious. But, um, and then June, I think I trespassed to jump in somebody's pool to symbolize summer. And we got that. Um, July, I don't remember what July was for. It was another summer one. August was back to school. Uh, September was me and his birthday. And then November, I laid my big stupid ass on, on the leaves. floor. And no, I laid my, I skipped October, but, um, October, I 
threw it, I put my butt on a, a pumpkin and then I put a spider on that that, that back fat. Mm-hmm. And then I did. Mm-hmm. And then I, I like went like that, raw. Yeah. Um, November, I put my ass on a plate like I was a turkey. How long took you to do all this? Days. Shout out Crystal. I know you hate me, friend, but I love you for that. Yeah. So because she, she took all of those. She was literally the photographer for that on I her iPhone. Deep. Yes. So, um, and then you just go and you get the pictures uh, printed out. You know, I didn't edit shit. They literally were done on my iPhone. That man got them pictures and cried, okay? Literally, like, I think I got pregnant that night. I gave it to him. Yeah, I did. So, there's that. Um, great gift. Next. Self-care baskets. Get your man a self-care basket. Men need, whew, they might not show, they need some self-care. Agreed. You, you can put some little notes in the basket. Oh, that would be cute. Yeah. yeah. Like, just I love you notes and, you know, motivational quotes. Like, make it so he has to find them. That would be cute. That would be cute. Like a little scavenger hunt in the basket. Yes. Open when letters would be good, too. Open when oh, yeah. letters. Um, Got you some when you went to college. She never mm -hmm. did it. She only used the one that made. No, I used them all. Yeah. No, I don't remember. I didn't hear you use them. I didn't hear you use them. Because I was supposed to call you. Don't give it. She only called me on the ones that said open when you need $50. That's another story. Um, You're a college student. Money is tight. So basically, the open when letters is like open when you need advice and then you like have something there. Open when so you, you need money. Like open when you need a hug. Open when you want to see a picture of me. You have a picture. It's like mm -hmm. open when open whatever when the you, situation Open when you're angry at me. <laughs> yeah, and it's like different. You're You're setting yourself up like I guess in time mm -hmm. like let me go ahead and uh, alleviate whatever may be happening with him or her and it's just like beautiful because whatever they're feeling something you can be the one to fix it um you said something else after the open one letters you said scavenger hunts mm -hmm. that, i didn't even put that on here so i had an ex that actually did that and that was so damn lit like he had me going all over the city and I had to basically yeah. find him. It was so romantic. That I is wish really I nice. loved him. I wish I loved him. He was so good <laughs> to me. Um, literally, he had it to where, like, we started in, like, I think it was like I started at work and it was like, hey, there's something, you know, he only did it through text. So it was almost like a fucking serial killer. It was crazy. Um, there's something behind the desk. Go look at it. And that led you to the next clue, which led you to the next clue. And that it was so all cute. around the city. And then the final clue led me to the hotel room, which we did the staycation at. So it was everything. Scavenger hunts all 2020. Come yeah. on. It was everything. I was so excited. It was like one of, literally one of the best Valentine's Day's He was like, he finna be my hubby. No, I never said that. <laughs> um, You can put some, um, what, some oil and body butters in the basket yeah. too. Yeah. Um, Bath and Body yeah. Works. They have a good um, selection for men. They have different things that you. They have different. I know they have different lotions. Um, I forgot what they're called. Um, I think it's called Relaxation. I don't know what they're called. Aftershave creams, deodorants, lotions, um, body butters, anything that they have a whole men's oh, line. They're so. like they're like actually like targeted toward. Um, what you need so they, I know they have some lotions like soothing they're for they're like literally say, it, it, they, they literally say they for like for like stress like you have like a lot of stress you know what I'm talking about okay yeah yeah I get it okay um we also get our father some because he loves it and they smell really good too mm -hmm. whatever y'all gotta do to stop having these niggas wear acts whatever we gotta do as a collective as a community Buy him something. Smell goods, colognes. You know how you be asking a boy like, ooh, you smell good, what cologne is that? And they won't tell you because they think you're going to buy it for another man. Bitch, I am. So, like, get something. Some Izzy Miyake, some uh, Gucci Guilty. The Prada one smells good. They got, I don't give a damn if it's Sean John, the old one, Michael Jordan. Something so they can stop wearing Axe. Um, also, this is a good time for you to put shade like, whatever you don't like about your man, you can put it in the gift basket, which will actually be really smart because it'll help him improve his Give stuff. Give him an example. So, perfect example. I used to have this one ex. He smoked black and miles. And, like, his breath was always hotter than a bitch. So, it was literally to the point where I was like, bruh, like, I, gotta, I don't know how I'm going to tell this man, like, you have to brush your tongue after you get, like, don't kiss me if you're going to smell like that and taste like that. So... I would put in the in the um gift basket. Let me get you a tongue scraper, cause that's what you need. Not a toothbrush, <laughs> cause you brush your teeth. <laughs> but you need a tongue scraper because all that yuck when your tongue be white, 
That means your shit stank. So get that. He got a nasty mouth. Get him some floss. Get him some fucking... Get him dentures, bitch. I don't care. Get him... um. What else? If you don't like his teeth, get him like Invisalign or plaque remover. I would, I would hope you would just tell him, but yeah, this is whitening, this is whitening. Whitening. But 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 men are like so I don't know, like they get they're really sensitive, honestly. Like you can't just be like, babe, you're like your mouth is like really yuck. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, so it's just a nice way. Oh, babe, this is what you do with this. Let me show you, and then you help that bitch do it every morning. And it's soon enough, he think he did it. He think. He ain't think you put him on. But really, whole time, you, you put, put him, him on. on. <laughs> no exit coming up. You put him on. Um, I got another ex. Lips drier than a bitch. I mean, we'll cut you with him. Loved him. So I like, you know, let it happen. You giving him a gift basket? Put some chapstick in the basket. Baby, this is for you when you, you know what I'm saying? This is the same kind I use. So we can have the same kind now. And he won't even know what's going on. Y'all need to be putting y'all men on game anyways. Yeah. Point blank. Um, this was something that came from one of our um, followers. If your man is not very well endowed, get him a book on the art of cunnilingus so he can help you help him help himself. That way, y'all don't have to be like looking at each other like, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? What the fuck you gonna do? Explain so you they don't they know. What like if his about. shit medium, like if his shit shrimp, shrimp, limp, lil, that's fine. But like, make sure he can service you in other ways. They want Amazon. They got a book right now, The Art of Eating the Box. Get him that. Put it in the gift bag. They have a lot of books. They got a lot of books. Um, if he's too hairy, get him a shaving kit. Get him a little groom, little situation, little, oh, this can get you raise it up, da 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 da, da. They got all little kits at Walmart. Um, what else? You can get him if he's, I just lost my place. I got him, like, this much weed or whatever. I don't know how much that is. It was a lot. It cost me, like, 50 bucks um, or more. I don't know. It was expensive, okay? It was, like, he only got, like, one other gift other than that. And I put all the weed, I had somebody do it because I don't know how to do it. And I chopped it up or whatever the fuck y'all do with a little grinder or whatever. And I put it in like four or five different blunts. And I rolled one big one like I was making a fucking pizza. And I gave it to him. Put a little bowl around it. That bitch say? was so happy. He was happy as fuck. He was like, nobody else had ever been that like thoughtful and sweet. And like, yeah, of course. I'm the fucking best girlfriend in the world. What can I say? Another um, thing you and your man can do is go on a couple's spa day and massage mm, all of that. You still got to use your massage that I got you for Christmas. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you could have brought get your Get some massages, get y'all's feet done together, everything. Okay, um, this was something that I found off of Pinterest as well. It was very cute. So, uh, this girl, she did like, it's kind of like teasing too. It's, it's real adorable. But basically, you can take, you can use the five senses, five human senses. So, um, sight. Taste, smell, hearing, and then touch, okay? So, she did a gift for each one. And not only was it super romantic, but it also, like, helped them, like, play together. And, then, of course, you can get to your final destination or whatever that way. Um, so, the smell, she put things in different bags. And then she labeled what they were. And then, of course, he's, like, blindfolded. Uh, if it's, you know, uh, if it's sight, you know, she basically hindered his other uh, senses so that he could hone in on what it was. Mm. So when she was doing the sight, she closed his ears and then she would just like let him see. Uh, the sight was her. So it would literally be you and a piece of lingerie. You know what I mean? So that would be really, really <laughs> cute. I love it. Um, what else? She had, and you could do like naughty or nice. Like you could do yourself in some lingerie or in something like this fully clothed. Or you at that point you can do your dance for him or whatever. Um, stripper poles on Amazon are like sixty bucks, FYI. And then um, she has I know, and then she had smell or excuse me, yeah smell. So candy, um, not really candy. I would leave that more for taste, but definitely candles. Put that in the gift bag. Food at that point you can also do the fondue idea that she mm -hmm. was just telling you about. Um, and then touch was like another naughty or nice so i think she had like two separate bags for touch so it could be like touch you or it could be like 
touch something and he have to guess like what it is it could be like an outfit or it could be something that he wanted if he's a photographer giving him like a camera or something you know what i'm saying he have to touch and tell you what it is <laughs> so that'd be like a yeah that'd be like a good idea or something um taste candy chocolate covered it fruit whatever the hell um edibles Ooh, can you imagine somebody gifting you edible that would be lit mm -hmm. um and then hearing i couldn't think of anything other than ear pods could you think of what you could give somebody for their hearing? For hearing? Yeah. No. Other than ear pods, no. I can't think of anything. Um, so yeah. Maybe just uh, if you're not trying to break the bank with like ear pods, or if he's just like a random nigga, he ain't your nigga, he everybody nigga. I would just get him like bitch some ear phones. Like we got knockoff version of ear pods. Correct. I call them pear pods. That's funny. Yeah, or like <laughs> bitch Dollar Tree pods. Whatever he can do to hear it. Um, so yeah, those are the five senses. Another bag, another gift you can get your man is a uh, gym one. bag. Uh -huh. So if he's a um, gym rat, or even if he's not, he goes sometimes. He likes to go hoop anything. Or if you want him to start working out, see another way to be like, babe. <laughs> but <laughs> maybe um, you need to get in gym. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, like so. Yeah. So yeah, you can get him a gym bag. You can like, you can actually make it like the gym bag a gift basket in itself Ooh. you can stuff it like with like protein shakes or like how they get that big protein powder yeah i don't know the type of pre-workout and protein powder yeah yeah well so you, can, you can put gatorade water bottles in it mm -hmm. you can even give him a pair of like some new type sneakers if you got money like that or you can get him some damn like shower shoes like if he wants to you know, yeah like anything, some, even some slides some slides that's what i'm slides, saying slides yeah. socks um you yeah. can throw some headphones in there they ain't got to be expensive kind just yeah. some you know, some they could be some rinky dink, just something to make the gift basket cute and a tote in like a whole summer. Weights, uh, yeah, weights you can, you can get them from Ross use, or Marshall. Though, like, you can throw like a rag in there, he could, like, uh, you know, sweat rag, yeah, so he can use when he sweats, um, uh, even a towel, mm -hmm. um, get gloves. I know they also have waistbands, yeah. So, yeah, you can give him some of those. Yeah, or the even the little belts that they wear to, like, I don't know what the fuck those do. But I think they're brace, back brace belts or whatever. True. even if he likes basketball, give him basketball. Give yeah. Him football. So, those are all of our ideas. Um, I think they're pretty, I think they're pretty good. Mm -hmm. I'm going to try some of them myself. Somebody's son. What? <laughs> I know it's so fucking gay. <laughs> anyway. Um, I think that's everything. So y'all tell us what y'all think. Tell us what we forgot. If you have any ideas? If we did forget, obviously you are always the gift sis. Wrap your ass up and serve it. You know what I mean? Mm. What? <laughs> that's a gift. The hell? Shit. I was literally just watching the video about that. <laughs> that is not a gift? That's what they were Apparently saying? the men think it's not a gift. Y'all got us fucked up. That's a gift. This man was like, we don't want no vagina this year. Okay, well then get some dick then. How about... <laughs> if you don't want none. Okay. Like, comment, subscribe, subscribe share. Subscribe, share. share. Follow us on Instagram. Spread um, love. Please. Okay. I'm tired of asking y'all. Shit, I'm just playing. We love y'all. Let us know what you guys want to be called. We still haven't thought of a name for y'all. No. Um, I get like I said, we already talked about this. <laughs> if, you don't, if you don't give us something, we just gonna call y'all whatever. We just gonna whatever. call y'all a relatable. Whatever we want. Relatable fam. Okay? Speak yeah. Speak up or forever. Hold we up. love you guys. Please hit the notification bell. Um, mm -hmm. I think that's everything all that all the fucking dumbass YouTubers say. <laughs> love y'all. We fuck with y'all. Out. <laughs>